Hey guys, it's Ashley Coupon Goddess. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. I am not going to spend too much on the intro today because, oh my goodness, look at all this stuff. I am just so excited with everything I was able to pick up. There was some deals that I wasn't able to pick up because um, of them just not having the product. And no in-store footage today. I am so sorry about that. My store is, the store that I go to and I love is remodeling. So stuff is everywhere. It took me so long to find things. They're getting new shelves. They're moving the Minute Clinic. They, um, the Quick Care Clinic, whatever they call it. Um, they're getting a couple self-checkouts. I mean, they're, you know, it's very noisy and all of that. <sighs> So I apologize, no in-store footage this week, but we have so many deals and so much going on. Where to begin? Oh my goodness. I did a total of four transactions using a couple different accounts. So we got freebies, money makers, um, paper products, big laundry products, diapers. Oh my goodness. So much stuff. Some food items as well. Free cards and more. So if you want to see how I did that and hear about the deals, then stay tuned. I hope you consider subscribing to the channel. Just take a second, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any future deals or uploads. So these deals at CVS are good for the week of September 6th through Saturday the 12th. So I'm going to show you two different options that you can go ahead and do for the um, spend 30, get $10 back in extra bucks. So two different deals that I did on two different cards. So let's go ahead, jump into the first transaction, which was over here. So the first deal is on the Orly Indicator toothbrushes. They are $5.49 at my store. Buy one, get a $3 extra buck. So I picked up one of the two packs of the Indicator toothbrushes, again, which are $5.49. We have a $2 digital in the CVS app or in your CVS account. Use that. You'll pay $3.49 out of pocket and get back a $3 extra buck. Final cost is just $0.49 cents for this two-pack. This deal is a limit of two, so if you wanted to do it a second time, you could. We just only have one digital coupon for that. Then I picked up one of these Scope 1 liter bottles of mouthwatch, which are on sale for $3.99. Buy one, get a $2 extra buck. We do have a dollar um, insert coupon in the September PG. We also have a dollar digital. Use that, you'll pay $2.99 out of pocket and get the $2 extra buck back, making final cost $0.99. Cents. Um, that deal is a limit of two as well. I paired it in with the Crest toothpaste deal, which is buy three, get a $5 extra buck because I was using, I wanted to use a four off of 14 um, oral care CRT. Now I really wanted to get two of the mouthwash. They didn't have it. So I had to throw in a fourth toothpaste to be able to use that CRT, but now that I'm thinking about it, I could have left the toothpaste off um, because I was getting the toothbrushes. So no big deal. It's not going to go to waste. So the Crest toothpaste select varieties are $2.99. Buy three, get a $5 extra buck. That deal is a limit of two as well. So if you wanted to do that, you could. So I grabbed four of them at $2.99. But you would want to grab two of or three of them at $2.99, totaling $8.97. And you could pair it in with the mouthwash. Um, there's a six off of four digital coupon. We also have dollar digitals that are glitching and coming off as well. So I picked up four of them at $2.99. That totals $11.96. I used the six off of four digital coupon bringing me down to $5.96 and getting back $5 in extra bucks makes it $0.96 cents for all four of them or around $0.24 cents each. So the toothpaste and mouthwash together together totaled me $15.95. I had the six off of four digital and the dollar off digital. I paid $8.95. No. 
um, which brings it down to $8.95, and I had that four off of 14 CRT. So it brought everything down to $4.95, paying that out of pocket and getting back $5 for the toothpaste and $2 for the mouthwash. So I got $7 back, making it free and a $2.05 moneymaker on all five of those products. Then select Colgate toothpaste are buy two, get a $4 extra buck. The deal is a limit of two. I wanted to grab the Colgate essentials. They didn't have that. Those were $6.49, so a little bit less expensive. Um, but like I said, my store was out. So I grabbed two of these Colgate sensitive toothpaste with whitening, which were $6.99 each which totaled me $13.98. I had a four off of 14, any toothpaste CRT that I paired in with this deal. And there is a four off of two digital coupon. So that brought me down to $5.98 out of pocket. And then for buying two, you're gonna get a $4 extra buck back. So it made my final cost $1.98 for both or just 99 cents each. And those are a bigger tube and they're more expensive um, of a toothpaste. Let's see, the size on those is six ounce. Then I grabbed the Nivea lotion, which is buy two, get a $5 extra buck. So I wanted to pick up two of the ones at $5.99, the smaller bottle, but my store only had one. So I grabbed one of those at $5.99 and the bigger one at $8.99. I grabbed this one with the free sample because I felt like I was getting a little something extra. So both of those told me $14.98. I had a $2 digital for one of them and I had a $2 paper coupon which now that I'm looking at my receipt, I should have used two of the $2 paper coupons because I don't see my $2 digital on my receipt coming off. But the $2 paper coupons I had printed off of coupons.com a couple weeks ago, so I don't think they're any longer available, but if you do have expired ones, CVS does take expired coupons, at least mine do, and they scan perfectly fine. They don't have to be like, you know, entered in or anything like that. So um, I used, well, you want to use two of those coupons. Again, there is a $2 digital. I'll have to check and see. Maybe I didn't have it clipped on this account, but I could have swore that I did. Those, so those $2 coupons would take $4 off. I also had a two off or a three off of 10 any lotion CRT. And I had a $2 CRT off of any Nivea lotion. So all of those brought my total down to $5.98. I got back the $5 extra buck. Final cost was 98 cents for both or just 49 cents each. And remember, we did get one of the bigger ones. So that is an awesome price. Then what fell down back there was the Nivea lip balm. Um, they're buy one, get a $2 extra buck. They were $3.19 at my store. I paid that out of pocket and got the $2 extra buck back. So final cost was $1.19. Super happy because I love peach and that is the flavor that I got. Then I had a $2 CRT off of any Sensodyne toothpaste. So I grabbed this one in the trial and travel section. It was... $2.69, so I paid $0.69 cents out of pocket for that. Then I picked up three of the Halloween Hallmark cards for $0.99 cents each. That totaled $2.97 for all three of them. I had a three off of two Hallmark CRT that took $2.97 off, making all three of those completely free. I hate to pay for cards. They're so expensive. Um, a lot of people will just throw them away. So I picked some of those up and they are super cute. They have a lot of really cute ones for $0.99. Cents. Then I grabbed one of these Chic Hydro Silk uh, Perfect Finish Trimmers, which was $19.99. Now, it's usually a better deal to do it when we have a $4 digital that attaches to that, but I really had good CRTs and I was fine with paying $4.99 for that. 
I had two $5 CRTs off of the Perfect Trimmers, one from last week, one from this week. That took $10 off. And then I also had a five off 20 shave CRT. So I paid just $4.99. I don't think that's a bad price at all. We're not getting anything back. Like I said, it's a better deal when we have the $4 digital and it may make it just $1.99. Then I grabbed the Poise Ultra Thin Pads for $5.99. The Active Collection and the uh, Silhouette are on sale $5.99. Buy one, get a $2 extra buck back. Now, these Ultra Thin Pads are included. My store was out of the Active Collection and the Silhouette. Um, I was looking for them. So they're $5.99. Buy one, get a $2 extra buck. We have a $3 digital, which brings it down to $2.99. I also had a $3 off of adult care underwear or pads, and I don't see it on my receipt. So I'm not sure what happened to that. I could have swore that I handed it over to her, but I don't see it on here at all. But if you have that, Go ahead and use it. You will pay nothing out of pocket and you'll get the $2 extra buck back, making those a $2 money maker. If you don't have it, um, you can still grab them for 99 cents after getting your extra buck back. Then I also picked up some CVS Health brand of the baby wipes. I love these baby wipes. They are amazing. Um, super soft and super durable. They're buy one get one half price, so I grab the three pack for $6.99, and then I grab the um, single one half price at $1.60. So those totaled $8.59, and I had a three off of eight uh, CVS Health brand baby items CRT. That left me paying $5.59 for all four packages or around a dollar and 39 cents like for each single pack because there's three in there so I think that is a great price all right so let's take a look at the receipt there's all for the crest at 2.99 each the poise 5.99 the sensodyne the wipes buy one get one half price the lip item of the Nivea the oral-b toothbrushes the Nivea lotion the other Nivea lotion, the Hallmark cards, the Colgate, and the Chic. Here is my receipt. Here is the $2 paper coupon right here, which was for the one Nivea. There's a six off four uh, Crest Digital, four off two Colgate, $3 off of the Poise, and a dollar digital that I also had clipped for the Crest. There's the $5 CRT for the Chic, the 5 off 20, the other 5 off, 4 off any toothpaste, $4 off of the Crest Scope Oral-B items, 3 off 8 CVS Health Baby, 3 off 10 lotion, two or $3 off of the two Hallmark cards. You see it adjusted down to $2.97, $2 off the Nivea lotion, $2 off the Sensodyne, the rest were extra bucks that I used to pay, and I did have a subtotal of $1.85, which is, I'm assuming, because my $3 CRT didn't come off for the poise. I could have swore I handed that over to her. Anyway, I paid with a Fetch Rewards gift card. I had $5.78 in tax. So with tax, it was $7.63, and like I said, I used a gift card to pay that I earned from last week. I am jealous of all of you that have like 7% tax, 6% tax, so on and so forth. Um, but yes, so $1.85, I used $36 in extra bucks to pay, so... If you didn't have extra bucks, it would have been $37.85. We saved 98%, saved $96.47. Yes, it was late when I went to the store. Um, I had to work all day long. Oh my goodness. Worked yesterday. So yeah, it was late. Late for me getting to the store. And then I got back $23 in extra bucks. So final cost of that transaction was $14.85 for all 18 items or $0.82 cents each. I will be scanning my poise to um, 
Fetch Rewards because that is a bonus brand. I think the Nivea is as well. Um, I have like when you spend $15 worth or something like that, you're going to get like 1,200 points back. So I'll be tracking towards that. And I'm going to scan my receipt to pggoodeveryday.com and get 250 points back for the Oral-B crest and uh, the scope items there. So that will be like a dollar and sixty seven cents back, which will bring my total down to thirteen eighteen or around seventy three cents each. So nice little help out there. This transaction over here is a small transaction. I grabbed three of the L'Oreal mascaras for seven ninety or I'm sorry nine ninety nine each. They're spend fifteen get a five dollar extra buck. So I did the deal twice um, and spent thirty to get ten dollars in extra bucks. That deal is a limit of three. Um, what I used was a ten off of thirty L'Oreal cosmetic CRT. I had a two dollar digital. For L'Oreal Cosmetics and I also used the $4 instant coupon from this week that's printing out for everybody at the Redbox machine. So all three of those totaled me $29.97 after my CRTs and my digital it brought me down to $13.97 for all three of them getting $10 back in extra bucks plus for spending $30 on beauty products I'll be getting back a $3 beauty buck to my account in 48 hours. So final cost for all three of those is 97 cents or just 33 cents each. And this is going to help me um, get to earning a free L'Oreal mascara. When you buy four of them, I think then you get um, your fifth one free. You get like a coupon um, to your account. Again, I believe in like 48 hours. Then I grabbed this Visine, which is on sale for $4.99. Now, there was a cheaper one included as well, but I grabbed the more expensive one. Um, this is the Dry Eye Relief. So on sale for $4.99, not getting anything back for it, but um, this is always a great thing to have, especially when my husband works double shifts and he can keep them in his lunch bag or just, oh my gosh, when I've barely gotten sleep and then my kids have tons of zooms the next morning doing their e-learning yeah um so $4.99 I used a three dollar off any eye care or ear care CRT paid a dollar 99 for that not a bad deal so here is the receipt for that you see the Visine on sale $4.99 all three L'Oreal mascaras at $9.99 each there's my two dollar digital for the L'Oreal 10 off 30 CRT four dollar instant coupon three dollars off of the eye and I used extra bucks to pay. I had a zero subtotal. So I used, and my one $2 one did get adjusted down to $1.96. So I used what, $14, $15.96. So if you didn't have extra bucks, it would be $15.96 out of pocket. Getting back 10 for the L'Oreal, $3 beauty buck brings it down to $2.96 for all four products or 74 cents each. And I did get back my $10 extra buck. So it was $2.65 with tax. Um, I used, I had $2.37 left on my gift card. I paid $0.28 cents out of my pocket. And we had 100% savings. We saved $39.56 on that transaction. All right, on to transaction three. So this is your first option or the first thing that I did for the spend 25, or I'm sorry, spend 30, get a $10 extra buck. So what I picked up was the 18 equals, 18 double rolls equals 36 rolls of the Cottonelle toilet paper for $10.49. There's also the 12 equals 22 of the Scott paper towels. My store actually had a lot of those. They only had two of these Cottonelle. So I picked the Cottonelle up. We can all use, use toilet paper in our house. Um, those are also $10.49 though. 
and I had a 55 cent printable from scottbrand.com that I used for that. So then I picked up the large Tide. It is the 92 ounce, 64 loads for $11.94. I used the $3 digital. This transaction um, did not go as I had hoped. I paid like $6 more um, because they did not have the Mighty Packs. And I wanted to use those $2 insert coupons that expired Sunday. But my store didn't have them, so... It is what it is, and I improvised, and it's, it's fine. Um, $3 digital for that. I grabbed the all free and clear uh, 24 loads of the liquid detergent on sale for $2.99. I did not have um, any of the dollar insert coupons with me because I was counting on them having the Mighty Packs. So I had a $2 CRT off of the liquid for the free and clear or the Mighty Pack, so I used that for that. So I paid just 99 cents after that. Picked up one of the Tide Pods for $4.94. I used the $2 digital. So total for everything, totaled $30.36. After coupons and CRTs, it brought me down to $22.81 out of pocket, getting back the $10 in extra bucks. So final cost was $12.81. For all four products are around $3.20 each. So considering I got the Big Tide, the big thing of Cottonelle, and we cannot really get good deals on paper products. So I'm still happy with that. It would have been a better deal the other way, but no biggie there. Happy with what I picked up. Then I picked up the Spend 25, get a $10 gift card. I grabbed two of the L'Oreal Avive. I grabbed the purple ones this time, the purple shampoo. I don't have any of these in my stockpile. I'm tired of picking up all of the other ones, and they didn't have my daughter's favorite, so I went with these, two for $8. I used a... Well, I had a $2 digital, but I'm looking and that did not come off. <sighs> See, that was another reason why I had such a high subtotal. I don't know what is with these digitals. There is a digital for $2 for the L'Oreal Avive. Maybe it doesn't work on these purple ones. I don't know. Let me know if you guys had any issues. I also used a $2 paper coupon for one of them that I printed off of coupons.com. I would have just used two of the $2 paper coupons. Ugh. The Revlon, I picked that up for $5.49. I saved my instant CRT from last week, which was a $5 value for Revlon or LMA, I believe it was. So I used that and ha that brought it down to $0.49. Cents. I grabbed the Herbal Essences, Buy or Renew, two for 12. I used the three off of two manufacturer coupon out of the September PG. And I also had the three off of two digital glitch and come off as well. For all the hair care, that was $20 in hair care, um, and so I used a 4 off of 18 hair care CRT as well. So for that deal, it totaled $25.49. After my coupons and CRTs, I was left to pay $8.49 out of pocket, and I got back the, um, I'll show it to you on the receipt what it looks like this right here which is redeemable for the ten dollar gift card i just didn't re redeem it while i was in the store so i will have to go in um and redeem this so final cost for that transaction was completely free and a dollar and 51 cent money maker plus we spent 25 in beauty so we are almost at another three dollar beauty buck but with these beauty products right here, that should push us over that mark. Then I picked up two of these U by Kotex um, Light Days liners, 16 count. They're $1.79. Buy one, get one half price. Buy two, get a $2 extra buck on any two U by Kotex. So one was $1.79, one was $0.89 cents for a total of $2.68. I paid that out of pocket, got back a $2 extra buck. Final cost was $0.68 cents for both or just $0.34 cents each. Then I picked up some more of the Hallmark cards. Same deal as over here, so I'm not going to go over that again. I really needed nail polish remover, so I was like... 
I'm going to look at my CRTs. I'm going to throw this into a deal, not getting anything back for it. But I picked up this 10 ounce of the Beauty 360 nail polish remover, which was $3.69. And then I picked up the Beauty 360 200 count of the cotton swabs for $3.19. So for both of those that came to $6.88, I had a two off of six um, CRT. I also had two dollar off CRTs as well for those items. So that took $4 off, leaving me to pay $2.88 for both or just $1.44 each. I love using my extra bucks to purchase things that we actually really need. Then I picked up the cotton balls. I've done this deal before. $2.59. I had $2 CRTs off of Beauty 360 cotton um, or something else. So I paid just $0.59 cents for those. I grabbed this Neutrogena face bar for $3.79. I had a $4 off CRT for Neutrogena facial care. I used that and I believe it adjusted down. Yeah, it adjusted down to $3.79, making that completely free. Then I picked up four of the Pepsi 2 liters. They are on sale two for $2 this week. And I paired it in with the Reese's snack size bags, which are on sale three for $8. And everybody should be getting a two off three instant CRT at the Redbox machine this week. Definitely a great time to stock up for um, Halloween, even though who knows if trick-or-treating is even going to be a thing this year. I don't know. We're still going to participate, at least have the kids go around to our family's houses and they can trick-or-treat there. So the Reese's and the Pepsi totaled me $12.00. I used the $2 instant CRT for the Reese's, bringing me down to 10, and I had a three off of 12 food CRT. We can always use more pop in our house. We go through it like crazy. Um, so that left me paying $7 out of pocket for all seven items or just a dollar each. So we were already paying a dollar for the Pepsi, but we got the Reese's for these bags for a dollar. That is a great price. So super happy to pick up some snacks and some drinks for our house. Let's look at the receipt. Maybe if we can get this to focus. I don't know why it's not focusing this time. So here is everything that we picked up. Here are all the coupons, the $3 for the uh, herbal essences. I really don't know why this is not focusing. Um, so all the paper coupons, the digitals, both tides, all of our CRTs came off. We were left to pay a subtotal of $5.65. Now I did pay that with a Fetch Rewards gift card. So I didn't pay anything out of pocket of my own money. I did use my $10 care pass and I used $22 in extra bucks to pay. So because I only pay $5 for the care pass, we're only going to count that as $5 um, that we paid there. So the 27 plus the 565 comes to $32.65. We used, or where is our savings? Ah, we saved $92.07, 94% savings. Again, it would have been lower if I would have been able to get the all mighty packs. So we got back um, $28, including the $10 gift card, plus the $3 beauty buck. So it makes everything just $1.65. For all 18 items or just nine cents each. What? Nine cents for 36 rolls of Cottonelle, 64 loads of Tide. Yes, I will take that any day. All right, transaction four. Again, I did the 
Hallmark cards. Not going to go the, over that. The um, I did the spend 30. This is the other option. Spend 30, get a $10 um, extra buck. So this one, I added diapers, which are on sale for $9.99. So I grabbed two of those that totaled $19.99. Okay, we're going to say $19.98. And then I added in two of the Tide Pods. Now, if you have a second paper coupon or um, insert coupon, definitely use it. I just had the $2 digital. I had already printed my other one when I did my a different deal. I can't even think. I think it was my deal at Walgreens. I don't know. Anyway, $4.94, I used a $2 digital. And then I had a four off of 25 baby care CRT. So because the diapers didn't total that and I didn't want three of the diapers because we don't have another coupon for the diapers, um, I had the three off of two digital coupon for the Pampers. So I added in some more baby wipes, buy one, get one half price. One was $3.29. The other was like $1.64 or something like that. And that made up the difference for me to be able to use that CRT. So total for all of the diapers, the laundry care, and the wipes was $34.74. Using that four off 25 CRT, it brought me to $30.79. I had five dollars in coupons, which brought me down to twenty five seventy nine, and then getting back the um, ten dollar extra buck. So final cost for all six products was fifteen seventy nine for all of them, around two sixty three each. So definitely not a bad deal. It's not the best deal for the wipes. But everything else, the diapers, the Tide, it's totally fine. Again, if you have another $2 coupon, you, your total will be $2 less. So yours would be $13.79 for all six or $2.29 each. And here is this receipt. I don't know why this is acting crazy now, um, but it's just, it's not very clear. So I apologize for that. All right, so there's the Pampers, three off two digital, the $2 digital for the Tide, four off 25 baby care, three off 12 food, three off two for the Hallmark, um, two off three for the Reese's, and the rest were, was my care pass and my extra bucks. So I had a subtotal of 64 cents, paid that with a gift card, um, I had 84 cents left to pay in cash out of my pocket and we saved $73 and 70 cents, 99% savings. And we got back our $10 extra buck for that deal. So I hope this was helpful. I know it was a huge haul, really long video. I'm sorry. Um, I don't know. You could fast forward to the deals that you're looking for. So on and so forth, all of these deals will be in the description box below in a printable list for you. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you next video. Bye bye for now.